So under the average observer, this kind of looks just like a drive down a back alley. Uh, but lately I've been trying to inspire my comm class by thinking about what they'd like, talking to some of the kids, uh, and, and really trying to get them outdoors instead of in the confines of the classroom. So it turns out quite a few of my students are interested in graffiti and art. So I decided, could I find a place close by to the school where we could look at graffiti in, in more detail, look at tagging, uh, and design a lesson completely around that. So this ended up being the field trip component. You can see at this alley behind the Tim Hortons about two or three blocks from the school, uh, there's graffiti everywhere. All over these dumpsters, there's examples of tags uh, and, and various other things that we wanted to look at. So I designed a, a PowerPoint slideshow and found a documentary on graffiti and we framed the entire unit uh, around around is graffiti art or is it vandalism and do they think that their opinion will change over time is it different when they're young will it be different if they own a business etc so as you can see all these walls very close to the school have graffiti on them so we learned a bunch of graffiti vocabulary everything from terms like throw up to bombing uh, to tag to street art uh, and uh, and then we went out and kids had to examine uh, eight different types of graffiti. So they had to go and take pictures using iPods and their cell phones, etc. And then they had to present to the class. And that's what we're doing shortly on each one of these uh, examples of graffiti. What do they mean? What symbols they contain? Uh, are they prolific? Why they think they're prolific? What is the reason behind the tag? And they also have to use those vocabulary terms that we learned about in the slideshow uh, and explain to the class. So very busily. Uh, on a cold morning, we went up and down this alley. Kids uh, ran ahead, stayed behind, examined graffiti, asked about it, uh, thought about it, looked at it in, in great detail, and took their pictures. And then on Monday, what we plan to do is look at this in, in more detail, this, this subculture, really. And kids had a lot of insight that, that they taught me. It was an awesome dialogue to see kids teach me at the same time as, as I was teaching them. And just a great way to get out of school for a little while.